Hey guys, uh, Shoe God Sneakers here. I'm going to give you a quick tutorial today on Wrath Easy Supply Desktop Mode that just came out the other day. So uh, let's get right to it. Uh, starting with settings here, this is where you're going to input your proxies. Really straightforward user path, IP port, copy and paste it from a text file, and then click save down here. Profiles, this is where you're going to put all your prof profile information. If you have separate billing and shipping, you can click that to enter that. Uh, you have your credit card information and this is where you can name your profile nickname. You press create and it'll show up here. I have this test that I've already done or already set up so you can click that, load it up. If I ever needed to change anything, you could change it and then change uh, the name down here, create a new profile and delete the old and then keep the new one. So moving on to creating tasks here, Easy Supply is the only site that's supported as of now. And what you have here is queue bypass and variant mode. So for Yeezy, Yeezy drops on Yeezy Supply, you're going to want to use queue bypass. And what you're going to want to do is post the, the home address uh, in the URL. You're going to want to pick your sizes and pick your profile, quantity, tasks, capture. You're going to want to hit yes. You're going to want to create, so say I want, you know, a couple different sizes. When you go down to task, you're going to have everything show up here. So now what you're going to do for drop day is the day before, you're going to want to hit start all. And this is what's going to give you the cookies to skip uh, the queue. And so what you do is you wait, 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 you keep your computer up. You don't turn this off. You, you know, you make sure that you still have the cookies. And when the product goes live, all you need to do is push this. And you're going to go straight to checkout, and all of these are going to check out uh, with your proxies that you have in the settings. So this is what you're going to do for the drops. What you can also do is for restocks is you can do variant mode. So for restocks variant mode, when you have an item um, on Easy Supply, what you can do is you can get a variant ID for the item uh, for a specific size and what you can do to do that is you're going to hit exclamation point ATC and then the URL link you're going to put that there uh, you're going to copy this and you can post that in the, uh, the discord the RAS Easy Supply discord and it's going to give you a list of variant IDs for each size so what you can do is you can do that for the Yeezy and then get your size when the initial drop happens. Here's an example. This is for the extra small tank top. So you're gonna this is you're gonna have a variant ID. When the easy supply drops, you can get the variant ID and this is how you can set up your tasks. And it doesn't matter really what size you pick because the, the, the variant ID is tied already to a size, but you can still pick the size. You know, pick your profile, click one quantity in one task, you can click capture. Uh, in this case, this I, this variant doesn't have a capture, so I'm going to turn it off. And what you do is hit create. So for a restock, if it already drops and you know you already have your variant IDs, you set up your tasks and you're waiting. And as soon as that restock happens or you get that notification, you can hit start all, and you know it's just going to use the variant and go straight to checkout and you know start putting in all your information it's going to get stuck on billing because i put in fake information but that's basically it guys um i've used RAS supply before in the past i was able to cop 13 700s from YouTube supply back when they had the checkout jig and RAS was able to get those checkout links in you know in two seconds they were one of the fastest so i'm really excited to see what the desktop mode has to offer um, feel free to subscribe, like, if you have any comments or questions, feel free to write them and I'll be happy to answer anything that I can and good luck uh, with the drops coming up in the future.